gonna be a problem. What's up, Yoshi here, also known as Parker. Uh, we've got a really cool unboxing video today, and um, this is in, in lieu of the Switch being sold out anywhere. I just had that gaming itch, and the Apple Store is selling these babies, the Game Vice controller. Um, this company, I guess they're just called Game Vice. They make three different sizes, one for iPhone, one for iPad mini, and one for the regular iPad. Of course, I picked up the mini one, and we're gonna, we're gonna open it up and, and see if it's, if it's any good. There are tons of games that do support this. More and more games are being supported all the time. There's actually an app you can download that uh, basically is just a catalog of all the apps that support it. Work. But it's, uh, I really like the box. It's, it's kind of, it's soft like Apple boxes. We've got the front here and we've got the back, some more uh, side shots and it does work with all the iPad mini, iPad mini one, two, and three. It looks like we've got an auxiliary jack and a lightning connection so we can charge and, and listen to headphones while this thing is hooked on to the iPad. Da -na -na -na. Ooh. Ooh. Wow, yeah, this is like, this is very Apple-like. Really all it is is a controller that just adds buttons to your iPad. I think that's the number one reason why I hate uh, mobile gaming is because you you're just pressing buttons and then your thumbs get in the way of, of the screen and it's just not a very good experience. This kind of brings that experience to the iPad. And at this point in time, the iPads are even the small ones are so stinking powerful that we were getting a lot of console ports. And so I got this awesome case for eight bucks on Amazon. It looks pretty goofy, but Unfortunately, I dropped it before I got the case, and so there is just a little tiny lip up that I'm worried might cause a problem, but we'll see. So here's the game thing itself. Ooh. So we've got two tri- wow, we've got two triggers. Full-on triggers, and it looks like these are analog. They don't feel like buttons. I don't know, we'll see though. And then it's just the standard duck. The two analog sticks, the power button, the menu button, ABXY, and the D-pad. And then on the bottom, we've got a little battery indicator, the lightning connection, and the headphone jack. And that's it, like it's super simple. Got some documentation, we'll check that out later. Oh, please work. <laughs> Stretches and... So just like that. So it's kind of, a, if you already have an iPad, just a hundred bucks and you've got yourself a little Switch competitor right there. And the screen is a lot bigger too, so that's awesome. So yeah, that just launched, um, a special page on the App Store for the successor. Now I already have the Game Vice open, their app. Th these are all the games um, that support the gamepad. Oh, Crazy Taxi. So you can tap on it and see information and then there's a button that'll take you right to the App Store. So I already have this, do I have this installed already? Oh, I already have it installed. But yeah, so back in the Game Vice app, that has Walking Dead, got the Minecraft, Assassin's Creed, Call of Duty, Halo, what? I didn't know this was on the App Store. Ooh. We got Bully, Final Fantasy IX, and Final Fantasy VII, Grand Theft Auto. Oh, Dead Trigger 2, cool, I already have that. The Binding of Isaac. Um, oh, Lego Batman. Like, there's a lot of really good stuff. Oh, Limbo, ah, I love Limbo. And of course, a lot of iPads exclusive, like Modern Combat and a few other things. But, um, yeah, you know what? Let's check out Dead Trigger 2 really quick. Just a, a little shout out to myself. Um, there is a zombie movie coming out soon, starring Dolph Lundgren. You may have heard of him from The Expendables and Rocky and stuff, uh, called Dead Trigger. And I'm actually a zombie in that movie, so you might see me, but it might be a couple months before the trailer comes out. We just finished filming that a couple months ago. Just a shout out, it's based off of the game, and I'm a zombie in the movie based off of this game, so that's kind of cool.